Hi, in this video we're going to talk about an alternative way to uninstall software in Windows. So you're probably used to either going to the settings and then apps and then you could, you know, uninstall from there or modify if there's an option. Or maybe you like going to control panel to programs and features and then you see your apps there, you could do the same thing. But we're going to be using a tool called Uninstall View. So it's a free program, you just download the zip file and extract it, nothing to install. So when you run it, you'll see your programs here. And you could right click on them, uninstall, change. Some of them won't have the change option while some of them will. Like if we click on change here, it'll give you the repair option, you know, just kind of like you could do for Office and that type of thing. So that'll kind of start the uh, change process rather than uninstalling it. You could also uninstall the, open the uninstall item in RegEdit. If you want to get there, if you want to do something from there, open it in Explorer, save copy, copy and install string. I could paste that into Notepad and see what that looks like, like so. Copy the click cell. I'll just copy the name of it right there. And so we have the display name, the registry name, display version, time, install date, installed for, install location, created, modified, owner, publisher, string, all kinds of stuff here, URLs. As you can see it's a lot of information compared to what the uh, built-in Windows uh, tools will do. And then also if you want to go to the options here and load Windows apps, You'll see that you have everything else here if you want to do some, you know, uninstall some updates or other Windows components. So, and then we have some configuration options, run as administrator if you want, uh, file encoding, reg edit with elevation, some other display items here, allow uninstall multiple items, advanced options, you could do this from a remote computer or external drive or shadow copy. You know, it's got some filters. You want to show the grid lines. If you want to export items, all or some, to an HTML report. If you want to change the columns here, if you don't need all this information here, you could uncheck the columns and move them around. You could also drag them around up here too to rearrange them. You have some find options here, some copy options. Quietly uninstall, save properties. You know, so you got some good information if you click on that. And you could also uh, copy selected items. Probably have to paste it into something maybe like Excel to get a little better format there. But you could also do uh, save selected items. It'll put it in the same directory as the uh, software in a text file, kind of like that. So some pretty good information here. So I will put a link in the description, and then you could download it for yourself and see how you like it. All right, thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe.